Introduction to Chemistry Objectives Define chemistry Identify and describe the five main branches of chemistry Describe the three domains in chemistry Distinguish between pure and applied research And finally, describe how modeling is used in chemistry What is chemistry? Chemistry is the study of matter, the changes matter undergoes, and the energy changes that accompany those changes. What are the five main branches of chemistry? First, organic chemistry. This focuses on most carbon-containing chemicals. Second, inorganic chemistry, which concerns in general matter that does not contain carbon. Third, biochemistry, which focuses on matter and the processes of living organisms. Fourth, physical chemistry, the behavior and changes of matter and their associated energy changes. And finally, fifth, analytical chemistry, which studies the components and composition of matter. What are the three domains of chemistry? The three domains of chemistry are macroscopic, microscopic, and the symbolic. Macroscopic is from the Greek word meaning large. This covers everything around us that are large enough to be sensed directly by human sight and touch. Microscopic is from the Greek word meaning small. Some aspects of this domain can be viewed through a microscope, such as bacteria. However, most aspects of chemistry are too small to be viewed this way such as atoms. The symbolic domain is a specialized language used to represent components of the macroscopic and microscopic domains. Examples of this domain includes chemical formulas, such as H2O, shown above is the formula for water, and equations, charts, graphs, diagrams, and mathematical calculations. Distinguishing between pure and applied research. Scientists basically conduct two types of research, pure or basic research and applied research. Pure research is the pursuit of knowledge for its own sake. There are no expectations that there will be any immediate practical application. While applied research is carried out to answer a specific question or solve a specific problem, and it's directed towards a particular application. How is modeling used in chemistry? A model is a visual, verbal, or mathematical explanation of experimental data. For example, the model shown is a model of a water molecule. The hydrogen are 104.5 degrees apart from each other in a water molecule, roughly making a shape of a V with the oxygen, shown in red.